Okay, Coach, your men and women's cross-country teams competed in the Bill Libby Invitational this last weekend. It was a great improvement from week one on an overall team standpoint from the men and the women. If you could, just let me know how you evaluated your men and women's performance. Hey, overall, I thought it was really good. Um, um, Clay uh, had a great race. He was in there. He was more competitive this time against a little bit tougher field than the, than the week before. Uh, the girls are, are doing really well. A lot of uh, really good uh, competitive effort and kind of moving up. A lot of improvement in terms of time. Uh, the, the course is really kind of flat, so it's a little bit easier to get a time on that thing uh, on the Libby course. But uh, overall, I was really pleased uh, with it and their performance. You'll have two off weeks this, these next two weeks, and then you return home the 27th to host a meet at CB Park. If you could, just let me know how y'all are preparing in these next couple weeks for y'all's um, host event. Uh, this week we're kind of backing off just a little bit, giving everybody a little bit of rest, kind of uh, take care of some small things that have kind of cropped up because they have been working so hard the last three weeks. Uh, and we'll kind of move back into it uh, and try to get position ourselves so that we'll be, again, more competitive the next week at our, at our course. Uh, our course is kind of set up on like a European cross country style. Um, you can see the whole race from one point. It's a one mile loop. Uh, nobody gets lost. Uh, you can see what's going on. It's easy to know uh, uh, what your pace is, your one mile pace on each loop. And it's normally a pretty competitive meet. Uh, probably won't be a big meet. It'll probably be about five or six schools there at the most for the, co for the collegians. But it'll be competitive for us and uh, it'll be a good time for us to show something good.